Gather round, rascals, and thrill to the tale of how misfortune's keep found its crew. Come closer now, and meet two incompetent sailors called Squiffy and Bucko, who could drive any captain totally mad. Painting the ship didn't go quite as planned. Accidentally, the captain got a new tan. Hey, I don't know the dog you fought. Get over the you! When the anchor was dropped, they were fired and had to find a new job. Jobs as cooks wasn't a scoop. Window washers were their new jobs, but it ended up without any luck. Walking along the dock, they came across Clancy and Flintlock. <laughs> Pirates are so last year! Yeah, so outdated! They laughed. <laughs> then Nauticon appeared and had another plan. Squiffy and Bucko were about to get a new job. Squiffy and Bucko, always ready to get the job done. Faster, faster, faster. Squiffy and Bucko, forever the pirates, forever in the proud crew of Misfortune's Keep. Gather round, rascals, and thrill to the tale of how misfortune's keep found its crew. Come closer now. Meet Clancy, the natural-born pirate, bold and adventurous before he could even walk. Clancy loved to go to school, and he sure was a creative little fella. Even though his alternative ways were not always appreciated. But when you have a pirate's calling, a pirate's life it is. At any cost. No obstacle is too big, no mountain too high, no sea too deep. And Clancy practiced as bravely as any aspiring pirate has ever done. And then some. Clancy grew up to be a fine young reptile, full of dreams and hopes. Move over, Snakey, for someone who's just got a real pirate's ride on the one and only Misfortune's Cap. Lucky fella. Excuse me, did you think there would be room for two? I got the very last ticket, so beat it, land lover. And sometimes, when you need it the most, <laughs> fate can give you a gentle push. Stop lollygagging by the seaside, you lazy reptile, and get on board. You see, Clancy would never land a pirate's fare. Pirate Clancy reporting for duty, sir. Welcome aboard. Unless he fell into it. When the world is upside down and you fall over a lot, all you have to do is land on your peg leg and rise to the occasion. And Clancy did just that. Clancy, forever the pirate, forever in the proud crew of Misfortune's Keep. <laughs> Gather round, rascals, and thrill to the tale of how Misfortune's Keep found its crew. Come closer now and meet a young and competitive girl named Dogshank, who wants to win more than anything else in the whole wide world. I'm gonna win! <laughs> You're not gonna win anything! Oh, yeah? Victory! Woohoo! That's not fair! She wanted to win so badly. 
Did she even cheat it to be number one? But even then, she always came out short. Sometimes when you find yourself desperate, you'll turn to just about anything for help. I can fulfill your wish if you join my crew. I'll do anything if you make me win. You will not regret it. Now Dogshank was someone you had to look up to. Literally. Not the most attractive. Not the most athletic. But the best. <laughs> Yo -ho! Time for you to enlist on my ship. Welcome aboard. Make way for a winning lady. Dog Shank, stronger and faster than any pirate. Forever the pirate, forever in the proud crew of Misfortune's Key. Gather round, rascals, and thrill to the tale of how Misfortune's Keep found its crew. Come closer now. On a tropical island, Monk, the future monkey wrench, is hard at work doing repairs on ships and boats. He was the island's best mechanic, incredibly fast, doing four or five projects at once, never stopping to take a break. Until one day, he got a new visitor. A curious little monkey who was eager to learn some new tricks. lives on this island. Yes, that's me. I'm the fastest and the best. Very well. I have three wishes to give. Oh, well. I want to be the best mechanic in the world. And so fast, it's like the tools are part of me. And I want the monkey gone. Now don't listen to him. He's just a monkey. And so will you be. <laughs> Monkey wretch! <laughs> and with a skillful monkey wretch at his side, a ship was built. Bigger and more terrifying than any ship ever sailing the seven seas. Forever the pirate. Forever in the proud crew of Misfortune's key. Around rascals and thrill to the tale of how misfortunes keep found its crew. Come closer now. Meet Doubloon. He was a master thief, eloquent in any situation. This belongs to me, and this belongs to me. And that guy behind me. Hello, I must be going ta ta. And a master of escape. Most of the time, but always talking. Here for a, uh, a lot. But amusing. Which, in fact, I do, as these noble police officers, you guys, are doing a <laughs> Or escaping again, in masterful way. Where am I? Oh, hello, good sir. Can you guide me to the nearest exit to ground level? Of course. One turn. Oh, thank you, most humbly. Reptile brains. No wonder you're living in... And Doubloon was always on the lookout. Never for the long arm of the law. Glorious steel. We 
want for new loot. I'm new to these parts. Can you tell me the direction to Ninjago City? We could offer you a ride on a ship with ambitions. The sky is the limit. I I'm just an accountant looking for office work. F -f Find the long bridge on the other side of town. Oh, uh, thank you. I'm off. Numbers to be crunched. <laughs> Good luck with that um, sky ambition thing. <laughs> He was definitely lying. And Doubloon always knew exactly how to sweet talk his way to that loot. Hello, my useless friend. And see you not preferably again. This lock is a bit different. Not so easy peasy, ape statue, as I work on this lock. And he never stopped yeah. talking. And there's a magic involved. Until. Hey, about the time I learned Spinjitzu. Oh, oh. Whoops! Emma! <laughs> I did it! I solved your mystery lock. Is there still an opening on the crew? You were caught red-handed. And now of you... Of course! You will be the new addition to our crew. Two-faced, like you are. And now so wonderfully quiet. Doubloon, forever the pirate. Forever in the proud crew of Misfortune's Keep. Gather round, rascals, and thrill to the tale of how Misfortune's Keep found its crew. Come closer now. Meet Flintlock, a pirate saltier than any sea. We aim for the dew. Prepare a pirate's cannon. No sea ever saw a braver pirate than Flintlock. Must I do everything myself? But the luck of the sea can rise, and it can be cruel, or even mysterious. Wish I... I believe you summoned me. My pirate's eyes have seen their fair share, but a floating man in a sparkling... And I have a pirate's fare for you, if you wish. All I wish for is to be back on dry land. Your wish is yours to be. Flintlock knew that pirates have very few friends, and no pirate has ever found a friend in the desert. As dry as it gets. Only enemies galore. Right about now, I think I get it, my wish granting friend. And I wish to be someplace cooler, sooner rather than later. Your wish is yours to keep. Nor did the Arctic ever hold any attraction for a true pirate of the warmer water. in the ice cubes. I welcome excitement. And excitement was indeed in plentiful for Flintlock. Get me! Help me! Out. The brave and salty pirate finally getting his fair share of excitement. No, no, I wish... I wish just to stay on a decent pirate ship. Your wish is yours, Toki. Welcome! It looks like you have found your true calling after all. Flintlock, forever the pirate, forever in the proud crew of Misfortune's Keep.